Alright, here we are with another red robot stage. And get it less time. I played the stage from him. We were up in the bronze core, I believe it was called. It was a really hard stage. Very visually impressive stage, but yeah. So, I wanted to do try this one out as well, and apparently this isn't a stage that's all that hard, according to a forum post there. So yeah, it will be interesting to see here. And yeah, like, obviously this one, <laughs> this one stage, this stage too has some very nice visuals going for it here too. And yeah, I also know that I am playing an updated version of this stage, where, where some jump has been made a little bit easier and, you know, some quality of life changes, I guess you could say. So yeah, I am indeed playing a slightly easier version than the original. Hmm, I'm very interesting that you can both take the bottom path and the top path there. Oh, <laughs> It's kind of weird, like, these tiles directly above me now, they kind of melt into the background a little bit there, so yeah. <laughs> it's a little bit confusing, almost. Ooh, but look at this. Uh, Stuff in the vaults they're moving, yeah. Pretty cool looking room this year, I gotta say. And I also like the music, you know, going with this here. Very ominous feeling, you know. Kind of fits the dark tone we got going here. Hmm, interesting, okay. Yeah, I, I figured there would have to be a secret over there. And yeah, I can already tell, like, Obviously, I have not played the whole stage yet, but, you know, it is this far, you know, this far in, it's a lot easier than Bronze Core there. Um, yeah. A much more traditional feel. Yeah, look at this this here too. Very traditional feel, you know, how you move here on these platforms. Um, you can definitely cheese this here, though, by simply doing that. Not that it's a big cheese or anything, but... <laughs> Pleasant stage. Ooh, look at this. Uh, for a second there, I thought I were going to have to like bait Toadman into the pit here, like having him immune to having him immune to the Buster and you know something like that. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking, and I'm dead. Are you serious, dude? <laughs> I died to Toadman. <laughs> I died. To Toadman. Let that sink in for a bit there. Yeah, let's just not die to Toadman again. <laughs> yeah, if you start charging as soon as the shot is released, you can just keep doing this to Toadman. Like, poor guy. I was kind of tempted to jump down in the middle hole there, in the boss room, but yeah. <laughs> I decided against it. Oh, okay, now we have rain. That's certainly going to make things more interesting here. And harder as well, more than anything. Yeah, I'm just not, yeah, just don't panic when you see those guys, just stand still. And I'll be fine. Okay. And it kind of looks like we have a secret down there. But, yeah. Okay. No secret. You know what? <laughs> Don't go yet. Okay, I see. Ooh, yeah, nifty little... Yoki block segment there, and... Ooh. Oh! Jeez! Um, we're gonna have to charge up here. And now just do not fall, that would be... Yeah, <laughs> that would be annoying. 
And do we want to go down here, through here? I, I kind of want to see what's up here first. Hmm. Oh, yo, 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 SOS. <laughs> yeah, we're just going to go in here. I screwed myself. Okay, so you gotta jump straight up there on the second double platform there. Okay. Alright, back here again. So there, we gotta jump up. Okay. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I got on shorter. Okay, right up, right up. No! Oh my! Okay. No, I just had the chance. Oh, oh my god. Okay, so more forward than on the last one. Whew. Okay, fourth time here. Let's do it. Oh my god, that was close. Oh, oh my god, I made it, I made it, I made it, I made it. I made it. <laughs> okay. At the very least, yeah, we get a freebie on our way back here. That's, yeah, that's very kind. Thank you very much. Oh yeah, that took me a couple of times to get. Um, I probably did not have to die or, you know, <laughs> retrack my steps there four times. I just kind of played it a little bit hastily and, you know, ended up dying because of that. And yeah, this series where the bubble shield comes in. Yeah, very nice. Taking out those guys from very far away. Very, 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 very nice. So I'm definitely happy I did that. Imagine doing that while the snake guy shoots at you. <laughs> that shit would be nasty. Cool, nothing too hard. Even if you fail that, you don't die. And hmm, you know what? There you go. Yeah, best way to deal with these guys: just keep shooting, <laughs> and you know, get get all close up and snug with them, and you know, just shoot through their shields. Alright, another very nice checkpoint placement there. Ooh, and we have the boss already. I think this is the main boss. It sure looks like it. Oh, oh crap, dude, the rain is going to be messing with me in here. I can already tell. But yeah, like so far, this has only been a 11 minute recording. Very, very breezy stage. Like, assuming I don't, like, die a hundred times against Pumpman here for whatever reason. But yeah. I don't see myself doing that. But holy crap, the rain is very strong in here. Nice. Okay, well... Nothing too bad there, like, had I not been able to slide under the platform there, this would have been a miserable <laughs> boss fight. <laughs> like, being blown around by the rain while fighting a boss, I can't imagine that being easy at all, but yeah. Very cool stage red robot, I'm definitely happy you tuned down the difficulty a little bit. Like, the only really hard part was that E-Tank, no, I mean the pump shield there. Um, I guess the only kind of, you know, regrettable thing, I guess, is that I wish we got the chance to use the pump shield a little bit more uh, you know we did I did all that work and I only had to use it like against a snake head there <laughs> that was basically all the usage I got out of it so yeah but still like all around you know nicely presented stage um, and yeah how should I put this nice visuals the layout was good like and fun to interact with especially the Yoki blocks and yeah some you know some more space in between enemies so that it was easier to move this time around. 
like unlike with the bronze core where you know you usually stuffed a lot of enemies in tight corridors and yeah here we had more move movement or more room to move around in so yeah like definitely a really cool stage here so yeah i guess i'll just leave it at that um thank you guys for watching and have a nice day